This is a highlight from Speaking Out Peace podcast. I'm Annie Luck. In the season premiere episode of Speaking Out Peace, Maya Sotoro Ng, an educator and activist from the United States, talks about how she keeps her optimism as she works with the different communities to tackle challenges that sometimes feel insurmountable. Well, I am fortunate to work with young people and to have that as a central mission. And young people really get it. They're very inclusive. They know climate change is real. They have a desire to cast in it widely and they don't um, uh, accept as readily that things are the way they are uh, inevitably. And they really see the possibilities of conflict transformation and they help me to retain a sense of optimism, but also the emphasis of action in all of these initiatives is very helpful. If I um, start feeling despondent about climate change, but then I am working with the community to think about how we can help um, farmers and increase food sustainability. If I am bringing together, um, you know, communities from the Compact of Free Association and in Micronesians with Hawaiians and thinking about um, how we can uh, engage in different definitions of hospitality. If I'm looking at, um, you know, be building um, uh, better uh, urban spaces that are more sustainable. If I am in schools talking about personal choices and the ways that we can impact or you know how to push policy and all of those uh, endeavors, um, I'm not you know, working to save the world. I'm working to save myself and to retain a sense of (laughs) optimism because I can see that there's so much that we can do. And even if I don't have the climate science, for instance, that is needed to um, invent mechanisms for carbon capture, I can still do a great deal uh, to uh, feel empowered and to feel as though I am making a contribution. Thanks for listening. If you're interested in hearing the full episode with Maya, please look for Speaking Our Peace wherever you pick up your podcast or from our website, speakingourpeace.com. We'd love to hear from you. You can reach us at speakingourpeace at gmail.com or follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Our Peace Podcast. See you next time.